And now to the search for the person who killed four year old Michael Moultrie. He was shot in the head while getting a haircut last week. Our Jackie Kostek is live at St. Sabina Church after speaking with the boy's parents. Jackie. Erica, when Michael's mother came to speak to us today, she stood in silence for several moments and you could really feel her grief, the way she is longing for her son. And that's really what today was about, sharing who Michael was and urging anyone who has information about his shooter to come forward. MJ loves the beach. Uh, MJ loves riding his bike, going to the park, playing with other kids. He loved watching his favorite movie cars. But like the McQueen, that's his number one, that's it was his number one favorite car. Like. The parents of Michael Moultrie Jr. telling the world about their son, the four-year-old pre-K student who was shot and killed while getting his hair braided inside of a woodlawn home on Friday night. Seeing so much joy, so much energy, so much positive knowledge that he has, the, the, the charismatic smile that just lights up the room. Like, I can't believe that I won't get a chance to witness that anymore. Michael's parents standing united hand in hand outside of St. Sabina Thursday. We just asking that y'all just come forward. And calling for anyone with information about the shooter to come forward to police. And y'all took him for no reason. Y'all don't know me. Y'all don't know my baby. Y'all don't know his father. Y'all just came to where we were and like no planning, no nothing. You guys just shot into a house and y'all killed him for nothing. For absolutely nothing. He didn't deserve to lose his, his life. Michael and his mother were actually visiting from Alabama when he was shot, and she says that when she came to Chicago, people would say that she should not have fun, but be safe, a really a referendum on our city's violence. Outside of St. Sabina Church, Jackie Kostek, CBS 2 News. Oh, that is horrible. Thank you, Jackie.